Army ants have two funny common names here. The first is limpiadores because they come in and they clean up all the pests that are in the houses and they leave. And the other is saca pantalones, which means literally take your pants off. And that's because if they get into the, your pants, they will bite and sting you. One of the traditional uses for army ants is kind of do-it-yourself stitches. So if you're out in the forest and you get cut and you need something, you can grab some of these soldiers with their big mandibles and just put them on the area that needs to be stitched up and they will hold your skin together hopefully long enough until you get to the hospital. Army ants are very nearly blind and so they use what are called trail pheromones to follow each other around. The one in front dumps down a smelly chemical that the other ants recognize and then follow. Because the army ants are basically blind, they recognize their food by touch. If their food moves, they know it's something that's edible. And then the big ants will hold it down and the little ants will come and sting it to death. And then they will carry it off. If you are something that is stuck in the middle of this army ant path, there are two things you can do. One is to just stay completely still and hope that they don't notice that you're alive, and the other is to just jump frantically out of the way. And so you get a bunch of birds here called ant birds that will follow the army ants and eat anything that is jumping out of the army ant path. So it's literally out of the frying pan and into the fire.